Thank you, Mr. Deputy Speaker. Can I first of all welcome the £900 million which will be available to the Northern Ireland Executive? And I think that it's a reminder to the people of Northern Ireland of the economic security which we have as being part of the United Kingdom and also the part of consequences for Wales and Scotland should be a reminder to people there as well of the benefits of the Union. Um, could I just ask the Chancellor one thing about the levelling up fund, the infrastructure bank and also the um, shared prosperity fund? When will he have the details of access to that and can he assure us that the access to, to all of those funds will be uh, equally uh, available to different parts of the United Kingdom. Mr. Deputy Speaker, I can give uh, the honourable gentleman that assurance. These are UK-wide programmes, and we hope to have more details about the Infrastructure Bank uh, in the spring, so it can get up and running, at least in shadow form, as quickly as possible, and making a difference to communities all around uh, the United Kingdom.